Hello, I'm Dr. Steve Lears and this is a Society for Vascular Surgery briefing about the RPVI credential and vascular surgery. The non-invasive vascular laboratory is central to the management of vascular disease and was first developed by vascular surgeons to help with the diagnosis and treatment. It has now evolved into a highly sophisticated ultrasound-based laboratory integral to the diagnosis, treatment, and follow-up of patients with vascular disease. The vascular laboratory studies cerebrovascular disease, aneurysms, peripheral arterial and venous disease. In many cases, treatment decisions are made solely on the basis of findings of the vascular laboratory. The quality and dependability of information provided by these laboratories therefore assumes critical importance. The American Registry for Diagnostic Medical Sonography, or ARDMS, is a nonprofit organization which promotes quality care through the certification and continuing competency of ultrasound professionals. There are currently over 60,000 active registrants holding the ARDMS credential in either sonography, echocardiography, or vascular technology. The Registered Vascular Technologist, or RVT, is central to the function of any major vascular laboratory. In 2006, at the request of vascular surgeons, ARDMS launched the Registered Physician in Vascular Interpretation, or RPVI, credential. Earning this credential validates the physician's knowledge and clinical expertise in the interpretation of vascular ultrasound studies. To date, over 600 physicians have earned the RPVI credential, which has now been recommended and recognized by the Intersocietal Commission on the Accreditation of Vascular Laboratories, or ICAVL. The credential has been earned by vascular surgeons, cardiologists, radiologists, and it's now been recognized in China where the examination has been administered in a pilot study. The PVI examination covers ultrasound physics, cerebrovascular testing, peripheral arterial, venous testing, visceral testing, and specialized areas such as endovascular follow-up, intraoperative assessment, graft surveillance, and dialysis access evaluation. The examination is four hours long with 200 multiple choice questions. Examination delivery is via computer in a proctored Pearson View testing center accessible throughout the United States. By obtaining the RPVI credential, a physician is demonstrating his or her expertise in the non-invasive evaluation of vascular disease and its application. When reviewing studies from vascular laboratories with credentialed interpreters, the ordering physician can be assured that the results are accurate, dependable, and consistent. For more information about ARDMS and the RPVI credential, visit the ARDMS.org website. This briefing is made possible by a grant from Cook Medical. To learn more about vascular health careers, visit vascularweb.org.